Okay. Hi guys, I'm Jason and I'm going to play Mario Kart 8 for everybody today. And I'm hoping people will like my video as I play. Play Mario Kart 8. I'm gonna do 100 CC. And I'm gonna play as my favorite character, uh, Iggy. You like this crazy guy with big glasses. And this is actually a good car and wheels and hang glider. And I'm gonna do Mushroom Cup because it's the very this is the very first video I'm doing, so I'm gonna do Mushroom Cup, which is kind of like you know the easiest track to do. So I'm hoping people will like the video of me playing, and maybe I can like talk about like how easy and good the track is. Now this might not be the hardest track to play, but it's pretty cool though, cause you're like. Cause there's like a big like gigantic thing that says like a gigantic statue of Mario on it. You can also listen to the music too, it's pretty cool. Who is this in front of me? Bowser? Yep, Bowser. No, that's no that's baby feet. That's baby Daisy. Darn it, I should have kept that banana peel. Huh. Look, there's a little ramp right there, but that one needs like a speed boost. But since I'm in first, I'm not gonna really need it. The red turtle shell. The red turtle shells will track people who are in front of you. So even I just threw it in front of me, it's not going to matter. Now for the Wii U, if you shake the control... Oh, crud, I got hit by lightning. That's okay. Now over here, when you go off the ramp, there's like a, a bunch of speed boost ramps and you can jump off the thing. When you play and you like go off a, like a, like a, a ramp, like a stunt ramp, if you shake the controller... He'll do like a little flip. Your character will do like a little flip. That's kind of funny. You might like. Like, look, there's like a big like statue of Mario in the in the cart right there. It's co pretty cool. There's a bunch of toads and like a helicopter thing, my bobber. And like I got turtle shell. Like there's a helicopter, like a news helicopter coming in on you. It's pretty cool. Look, there's a big Yoshi like picture over there. I never realized that. Yahoo! Yeah, cause there's like little, every once in a while you can see like little like screens in like the thing that like shows you. But sometimes if you look around the background, you realize how like cool the background really is. Like you'll see like maybe like trucks and stuff of it maybe. I mean you'll just realize how cool the background really is. Like look, isn't that like little hover helicopter thing supposed to be like like the thing Bowser Jr. is always riding in on Super Smash Bros. I mean, that's weird. Why would like Toad be in like like Bowser's Jr.'s like helicopter thing? Uh, the anchor squid. The pig with the the thing with the anchor squid is that every time it like gets somebody, every if, if you get the anchor squid, everybody in front of you will get like ink on your screen. But usually it'll either give you like two, three. Or one like splat of ink to easily avoid. Yeah, Iggy, first place, 15 points. Yay. Next race. This next race is actually pretty cool, cause it's uh, called Water Park, and it's cool. You, you people, a lot. I think a lot of people would like this track. It's like a giant. There's like a submarine. Like it's it's really cool. This is a cool track. Weapon box right here. Summary. Like almost this whole track, you're pretty much in the water. Cause in some of the older games like Mario Kart Wii and stuff, you, you you're not supposed to go in the water. Usually the water is like a bad thing to go into. But like in games like Mario Kart 7 and Mario Kart 8, the the water in some of the tracks is like the main like area to go into. Oh, by the way, if you ever play this track and you see like the submarines. If you bump into the submarines, you'll get a speed boost. Cause like during the hover wheels, it's kind of weird. Cause in the hub during the hover wheels, you know, like the wheels that let you like go up walls and stuff. Um, it'll if you bump into somebody, you'll get like a speed boost. Like there's a little like bumpers that'll give you the speed boost. See right there was a red turtle shell. Like I said earlier, those ones will give you like boost. See, like, I get, like, two splats of ink. 
Yeah, the red ones like track you. The red ones are annoying. That silly mistake sometimes when they have like the like the little you know like the, the banana peel and turtle shell on like the back of them. That's like kind of it's kind of funny how many how many times I've actually get lost all my coins from doing that. Oh yay, fireball. What's best with this attack is just throw all the fireballs at once. Like don't the, don't wait, just like throw all of them and they'll like bounce around. Yeah, cause like watch if I I'm about to hit the submarine. Boop, speed boost. I mean like it's pretty cool and this is like the very first game where you can go up the walls and everything. It's pretty cool. This has gotta be one of the best Wii U games of all time. Uh, uh, darn it. Hit those blue turtle shells. You do not want to get a blue turtle shell hit by you. If you're in first place, um only people in first place will get like the risk of getting hit by a by a blue turtle shell with the spikes, cause cause they're like meant to track you. They're right? meant to track people in first. So like if you if you're in first place, you're you're gonna have to expect um you'll have to like expect them those ones a lot. Cause in my older game that we played Mario Kart we. I used to always play, and just about every single time I did a race, I'd get hit by a turtle shell. By a blue one. This has got to be one of the funniest tracks of all time. Cause look, there's like gingerbread toads. Like this is like candy mania. Like if you're like a like a guy who's like on a diet or something who like doesn't like eat candy or whatever, you may not want to play this track because it's like all candy and stuff like that. Sometimes, a lot of times when me and my dad see like candy in the store, he'll like joke about like it being like diabetes and stuff like that. So one day I'm going up to my dad while he's playing this track and I'm thinking, wow dad, you haven't even made a, a funny nickname for this track like Diabetes Gulch because it's all candy. It's all like, <laughs> it's all um, like candy and stuff. So <laughs> I'm thinking, I'm laughing about it right now. I'm thinking, I'm laughing, thinking about it right now. Um, you can just wait. Gingerbread toads, like gingerbread guys, like gigantic ice cream cones, like gigantic donuts. Sometimes I cannot tell whether the big like donuts are like Cheerio, like giant Cheerios or something. It's so hard to tell. This music is awful too. What is this like a violin or whatever? Oh my gosh, I just got hit by a red one. Jeez, you can do that. It's cheating. Oh, I didn't actually realize that the fish were actually um, in this track, like with the maple syrup. <clears throat> One of the things I could not tell about this track- oh crud. <laughs> Oops, I made a little mistake right there. Because in this game it's better because Lakitu, the Lakitu guy, will pull you up right away. But he, even in the Mario, even in this game, I know in one of the Mario games that I have, Super Mario Bros. U, he'll just like stand up there dropping spiny like shells at you and it's annoying. But in this game, he's even more annoying than that. He'll like take your coins if you, um, he'll take your coins if you like fall off a cliff. He'll take your coins like, like he's like, yo, I can't just pull you off a cliff and like expect you to get a free, like, like he's like, I need some, I need some pay. He's like, like, you need some pay. Like, I found the character Lakitu just kind of annoying in general. I mean, he doesn't look anything like the other, like, Koopas or Turtles or, like, Bowser or anybody. It's weird. It's weird. What's kind of cool, when I first got this game, I found out Kiggy characters like Iggy and, um, like, Iggy. Like, I'm playing now. He's like a, he's like a special level boss in one of the, in, Mar in one of the Mario games. He's like, in the edge of each world, you get to battle like Iggy or Larry or Roy down there at the bottom. It's, it's, it's pretty cool, because I have that game and I've beaten, oh, I've beaten two of them already. And they always seem to be my favorite characters. 
Now, this track right here has got to be one of like the best of all time, Swamp Ruins. Every time I've seen like a movie or a cartoon, like like with like a like they're like these people like discover like this like castle, like a ruins of like ancient like species of aliens or something cool like that. They always like make it like an ancient species that's like been there for like a long time on Earth or whatever. Like so, like it's kind of cool. Like the Thomps must have been there from like the very first Mario Kart game. It's kind of like why they kind of made the this Thomp ruins, cause I guess maybe. Because they were there since the first game. She tried to get a mistake right there. You can actually easily avoid all the swamps in this game, in this level. Because, especially the part that I just did, you can just go in the water or on the hang glider at one point. Like, these guys are pretty easy too. You can just either go under them while they're like rising up. There's a shortcut right there that I actually have never took in before. Maybe I'll try that next time. Hang glider time! This is probably one of the coolest hang gliders because it's shaped like a plane, which is pretty cool. Toadette. I realized with every hang glider and car, like all the characters kind of have like their own like symbol. You know, like Bowser has like every time you die in one of the Mario games, there's like a big Bowser symbol that like comes up and like 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 shrinks into the screen or whatever. Like, look, look at the edges of mine. It has, like, the symbol for, like, Iggy, kind of. Like, they each have, like, their own, like, special symbol. I mean, like, Dry Bowser, his symbol is just, like, Bowser. Like, the same thing as Bowser's, except the jaw is, like, deattached. Like, the jaw isn't, isn't there. Ooh. Oh, man, that sort of scares me right there. Like, look, like, a little symbol of him, like, on the plane. <laughs> like, every car and every hang glider has that. Like, a little symbol of them. Okay, final lap of the final race. Man, my video is almost over already. It's quick. In this part, you can go on the walls to totally avoid those gear thingies. That, I don't even know why they're like gears. Like, gears. Like, it's weird. Whoa! Man. Oh, sheesh. Like, look, you don't go into like a giant swamp now. That's pretty funny. It's kind of funny how like they look so peaceful when they rise up, like like ooh peace on earth, like they're like like peace on earth and stuff like that. Like they smash down, they're like all they ticked off. They're like oh I hate you. Like they look all ticked off. Yahoo! First in every race. We can watch like one of the replays of my races and that will be kind of the end of my video. That's the end of my video. That's the end of my video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like it.